Hello and welcome to my support solution YouTube channel. In this video session, we will learn how to create a center contract in SAP. But before we start, if you have not yet subscribed to our my support solution YouTube channel, then click on the subscribe button, click on the bell icon and select all notifications to get the latest and free updates after every new video upload. If you like our video, then please click on the like button. Also share our view. Now we'll start our topic. So first we'll take example and then we'll do practical. Our company is ABC Limited. We have two plants, 1000 and 0001. These are our plan codes. We have one central purchasing organization, 1000. And we have one vendor, 1000. This is our vendor code. Now with this vendor, we have created a quantity contract for 500 pieces. Okay, for our material 100-100 now our requirement is whenever we create a purchase order for our plant 1 that is 1000 plant the price should be the 90 EUR and for plant second that is for 0001 plant the price should be 100 at the time of a creation of a purchase order although we have created a contract with our vendor for a single material 100-100 for 500 quantity ok so this is our requirement now in our practical session first step is by using transaction code ME31K we can observe the below screenshot of agreement type MK second for our uh, central purchasing organization and in this below screenshot that is a third screenshot total target quantity is 500 pieces for 100-100 material code agreement type is MK so this will be our first step now here in ME31K transaction code itself what we will do under this first line item that is 100-100 line item we will add the plant specific information plant specific rate here we can observe for conditions triple zero uh, this is for our first that is 1000 plant okay for this material the rate is net price is 90 and for second plant that is uh, that is triple zero one plant the price is 100 100 EUR okay so under this line item we will add the prior plant conditions okay under document type or agreement type mk that is quantity contract okay now in our second step we will create one purchase order with reference to the earlier contract created the main contract Okay, with reference to contract, we will create a purchase order. And in this purchase order, we will add two different plans that is 1000. Line item one is for 1000 plant, and second line item is for 0001 plant. And here we can observe the difference in the net price. First line item price is 90 EUR, and second one is 100 EUR in the same purchase order with reference to the quantity contract which we have created so uh, these main two steps now we start our practical so first step create a contract ME31K transaction code ME31K presenter our vendor is 1000 agreement type is MK that is quantity contract MK quantity contract purchasing organization is 1000 purchasing group is 1 enter we have to give the validity and let us say 31st December 24 language is English Now material code 100 dash 100 and target quantity let us say 
5000 net price is let's say 120 we can refer to our example okay now under this line item 10 that is our first line item we will add the plant specific information plant specific rate now here okay click on edit select plant conditions and click on overview so we will add two plants one by one first plant is let's say triple zero one okay press enter now here we will add net price our required net price for triple zero one plant is uh 100 eur okay here we will add 100 or we can add through conditions also item conditions if required okay now we'll add our second plan that is 1000 plan and here also we will add the price as 90 this price will be for at the time of creation of a purchase order okay so we have uh, we add the both of our plants we'll take back and finally we will save our contract save now this is our contract number quantity contract created under number 460073 this is our quantity contract number now with this number with this contract we will create a purchase orders for two plants ME21N second step ME21N press enter outline agreement 73 is our contract number four six zeros 73 now here we will add our two plants one by one now we can observe the net price is 120 ur why because we have create a contract at the time of creation of a contract we have add this price 120 ur but yet we have not given plant information so we will give the plant information and then we will observe the change in the price 1000 and triple zero one Okay, the price has been changed to 90 and 100 UR respectively as per our requirement. And this is a material. Now we will add the required quantity for which we want to create a purchase order. Let's say five quantity each. Okay, click on check button. and save so standard purchase order created under number 45001127278 now we'll check the stats for the contract me33k display contract enter 5000 pieces click on item statistics release documentation 172718 
this is our purchase order which we have created just now so 5000 pieces is our actual quantity contract and open target quantity is 4990 and we have created purchase orders for 10 quantity under this contract okay and this is the respective value total value this is how we can create a center contract in sap by using transaction code me31k that's all for now in this video thank you for watching keep in touch and bye bye